My name is Jason Galliette. I live in Auburn, Washington. I'm 30 years old. I'm also a student at the University of Washington. I was working at the airport for quite a few years until I went back to college. And because I was in this sort of international setting where there's people from all walks of life, from different countries coming in and flying out, I realized from conversations with passengers that I wanted something more out of my life. I wanted to get out of my state. I wanted to get out of my city. Like, how was I going to get there, right? So I definitely wanted to get into coding, mainly because I wanted to travel and be kind of working remote and be out there. So I went back to college in 2017, and I went for a computer science degree. Unfortunately, I didn't know that there were so many prerequisites that were required for university, especially for CS degrees. So I realized, well, I can't go into CS unless I want to do two more years of school. So I decided to do the front end course with Udacity. I saw that Udacity offered front end web development training that would be free for members of the Blacks in Technology or the 110 group. And when I got in, like I said, it was an amazing program where it was very supportive staff, very supportive cohort. The experience was really fun. I think I had at least 100 other students online on Slack that we were talking together on problems that we were trying to figure out. We were showing our projects and everyone was cheering. So it never felt like I was alone. Going through the program itself, the structure of everything was really solid. We had instructor videos. They would range from like a, maybe 30 seconds to a couple of minutes. So you had a lot of information, but it wasn't an overload of information. And everything that they talked about in the videos, you would instantly go ahead and practice on. And then when you're going through your actual projects, you would have feedback from these mentors and this support staff that would say, hey, your code is great, but there are a few things that you're missing. You would have like a checklist that you would have to go through so that you can pass that project. Anyone who knows me knows I love Japan. I've traveled there many, many times. And so I ended up using my knowledge of JavaScript to create a Japanese travel blog website. I built a really cool animal trading card website. It was using HTML and CSS. And all of these kind of came together. My passion for Japan and my experience with HTML, CSS, JavaScript through Udacity to create a really cool Japanese quiz app that I did on my own. When I went to Udacity, I barely worked on JavaScript and now I know how to make a full web application now. So just being able to go from zero to a point where I can imagine something and physically conceive it is something that is really rewarding. Through Udacity, I finally got my front end certification and those tech skills that are desired for these tech companies. So I would definitely recommend the Udacity program for those of you who are a little worried about how to break into tech. I know from personal experience that it's really hard to break into it on your own. So this is a program that's gonna give you kind of all the steps that you need to really break into it.